Alright folks, we are on the lovely beach in the Dominican Republic from Punta Cana. We're here with Arthur William Cartwell. 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 And he's going to talk to us about this new book. So, tell us about the book. Um, the book is called Boy Pull Your Pants Up. Um, this is my first um, book. My first book. Um, basically, it's uh, a book about the different situations that people find themselves in and then the consequences that come along with them. So um, it's very edgy, it's very raw, um, but it's a lesson behind every story um, uh, Every story that's in there. So I'm going to show you the cover of the book okay. here. So what made you decide to become an author? I don't know. I, I actually, it was just... Um, something in me that I, I, I was approached in a negative uh, manner and I felt like I needed to write about it and I also felt like a lot of especially the youth um, needed to hear about what you know what I had to say um, it's dealing with uh, STDs and HIV uh, awareness um, but it's done in such a way where it's it's creative and it's not so preachy so it, and and but it is very you know but it is very graphic it's very graphic, it's very real, very in your face, um, and it makes for a good read. <laughs> so at the end of the day, when, the, when they're finished reading the book, I mean, what do you want them to, to, to get out of it? Um, just no matter what you do, just protect yourself, be aware of your surroundings, be um, cognizant of uh, the people that you associate with, um, and hopefully you can, either people are going to relate, like I've been there, or they'll be it, it, it will be where I know not to go there. So, no, you said you're from Baltimore and you said the book is basically about HIV awareness and everything. You know that the statistics are high in Baltimore when it comes to HIV. Very high. So, I guess you're, you're in the right spot to educate a lot of folks when yeah. it comes to that. Yeah, um, it is a book of short stories, and like I said, it, it's, um, it's I, my plan with this book is to reach out to some of the clinics. Um, and some of the um, colleges as well um, because I know that um, Baltimore unfortunately Morgan State and Coppin State they have like a high rate and and I want to reach out to them and being as though Coppin is my alma mater I definitely want to go home and and, and try to um, educate them a little bit on the on the topic now for folks who don't know you said you, you also self-publish the book Tell us about that process, about self-publishing self and everything. Um, I just I just went online. I actually had a couple of friends that are um, authors, um, and I spoke with them about um, the process. And it just took it took a lot of time trying to figure it out, but I had time because I just I was laid off from my job, so I basically dove into this project and and made it work for me. And I sell this, you know, I sell the book on my website, online, um, at willcproductions.net. All right, you got that, willcproductions.net. There'll yeah. be a link, so buy the book. Yeah, um, the, book the book is 15. 15 bucks, all right. book is 15, yeah. So, um, and it's also, I'm trying to get it into a couple of um, local stores in, 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 in Baltimore. I also have a, um, a webisode, okay. which um, what I did was I took... Um, three stories from out of the book and pulled uh, the segment a segment from each story and I basically acted that I cast um, you know some uh, cast some actors and I acted it out so um, and that is going to be on the website as well okay. and um, you can also go on to uh, YouTube and see it on YouTube and as well the um, you can put in Will C Productions and it will pop up All right, wow. yeah. So you got a webisode, you got the book, what's next? Um, actually, I am working on the second one. Um, it's it's a, a the prologue to uh, to this one, uh, to Sebastian, who is one of the characters in the book. Well, talk about the characters. Um, well, basically, each story has its own character. Um, we'll be here all day if I talk about every character. But they're black. Highlight. But they're black. They're white. They're you know different nationalities. It's it's different. It reaches out to gay, straight, bi. Um, it, it reaches out to everybody. So it's not just one sided. Um, it's just telling the story from everyone's side. Um, lesbian. You you name it. It's in this book. 
Um, so if you're unaware, you know, of the other side, you can at least get a taste of it by, you know, by reading it. Yeah. Uh, the sand is getting in my eye. So excuse me, folks. All right, I guess that is a wrap. Thank you, Mr. Will, for taking a no little bit of time out of your schedule to talk with us for a little bit about your book. No problem. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you. All right, folks, this is Andre's Flavor, and I'm here with Will. You gotta get the book. It's a good read. So until next time, peace.